not too much. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I think I already did an intro to this vlog. I'm not really sure. I did look it over so I may or may not trash it, but I know when I was talking, I had did a little bit more grocery shopping so I may pop that in. And then I was going to my auntie's wedding. Um, we did do that, we got there on time, it was really nice. I may pop in a few pictures or videos right here. But it's fun. If you're new here, hey y'all, my name is Akira Janae. Don't forget to subscribe and join the channel before you leave if I haven't already said that. So, I just got back from my man's house. I've been there for about two days and we have a lot of packages to open. One, two, three, four, <laughs> and five. So, I did already open, start to open this one. So I'm super excited about this. Um, this video is sponsored. I worked with this company. Um, I put the vlog right here. I can't remember exactly what I was doing in the vlog. Maybe it was like cleaning and stuff, but they had sent me pajamas and they also sent me like a um, swimsuit cover up top and you know, some really cute stuff. I wear those pajamas literally like every night like y'all see me in it on the vlog a lot of times so i will leave the pajamas and stuff that i got from this company as well i can't really pronounce their name of the company so i put it right here i do not want to butcher it but thank you so much for sponsoring this portion of the video so i think most of this stuff is from them um but then i have some other stuff from like other places so we're going to get into the stuff that is from them that they sent me all of this stuff can be found on amazon every single thing that i show you guys from amazon will be linked in my amazon storefront and it'll be individually linked down below so because i am about to cook i just got back y'all i just did a hair pickup order um just got back from getting prints from my parents house and just all kind of stuff i've been on the go the last like three hours oh i'm so excited so my whole thing of picking out was kind of keeping in mind that fall time winter time is about to come up and y'all know i'm slightly i'm gym girly i be trying to stay in the gym you know you know you know okay as i was saying it is getting gonna start to get cold here soon so i was trying to keep in mind that while i was picking stuff out so this is super cute it's just a cute little um pullover i got it in a size small reading the reviews but now i wish i would have got a size medium um this is like very fitted my normal size is a medium but i decided to get a small because the lady who was in the comments talking about her weight and height and stuff was like she got a small and it fits it fits good but i definitely probably would have got a medium just to have a little bit more breathable room because my boobs are a little bit bigger i think than hers was but yeah i like that it has a hole for the thumb and then i think this can like come in to where you can have like a shorter sleeve so yeah i like this i can't wait to wear this i'm gonna be wearing this to the gym just whenever i need a little pullover and i'll probably wear this to work because it's gray and i have to wear gray scrubs to work so this would be super cute just to wear you know it works so that i got that they sent me y'all know i just got into yoga pants and like leggings and stuff well yoga pants not leggings excuse me these yoga pants why was i thinking about wearing these to work 
they're gray just like my scrubs that i gotta wear to work the the quality of them just kind of makes me like it kind of reminds me of figs in a sense like the really really good quality but obviously at a cheaper price and then it has two pockets on the back it also has two pockets on the front i don't know i feel like i could get away with where it needs to work it's like cute scrubs or something but i got these in a size medium 10 out of 10 definitely recommend the quality feels really nice it is stretchy okay actually had another package <laughs> from amazon this is also in this haul this one is um tummy control shapewear thong women high-waisted compression panties um y'all know my stomach is not as flat as it used to be <laughs> when i'm gaining my weight i am gaining it all around but definitely it is you know in that stomach area lower stomach area um you know i already talked about that in a different vlog but i got some shapewear in the meantime until i go on my little like 30 day gym challenge or whatever i'm gonna i haven't tried these on yet but i'm gonna try these on hopefully it definitely sucks you in i got a size small simply because i didn't want a medium if i'm trying to like suck in like completely suck in so i did get a small and right off the bat i like that they got these little like slip resistant grip holds right here so you know when you do pull it all the way up i feel like this will stay up and it wouldn't ride down so how cute is this this is a two-piece set, long sleeve with some pants. It is cute. Like, you can't sell me, I don't look good right now, okay? Okay. Um, Tall girl friendly, probably not. <laughs> I'm 5'3", and it definitely goes all the way down to dang near just about to my heels. But if you're anything taller than 5'3", I don't know if they had a different pants length for y'all, but yeah, just about like five, three, five, four. That's about it. <laughs> so the second one that I got, it is in black, the exact same thing, just in black. I'm definitely feeling the black. The black is giving me sophisticated baddie, okay? Especially to match my black glasses. I feel like you can dress this up or down. Like I feel like you can do some heels for a cute little like, casual date night or something or this can be business casual like the options are limitless with this one and i really like it i'm loving it this one is giving me like just regular cool casual casual vibes the other item that i got from them this is supposed to be like a cute little like lounge around the house outfit so it's kind of like a little dress so it's like a scale up from the little moos that y'all like to buy from walmart then it comes with basically kind of something like a robe you'll just put it on over and it has a pocket right here and it also has a pocket right here um i like to keep my apartment set at 69 degrees so baby right now it's even cold so i like that i do have this little bitty you know robe sweater thing if you will to kind of just walk around the house with chill the material is really soft it's stretchy it feels nice so i'm really excited that i did decide to get something like this to kind of just you know chill around the house on like this so <clears throat> this one says amazon but this may be something that I ordered, so let's just open it. Okay, yeah, this is something that I ordered myself. I'm going to a business tea party tomorrow, so we're going to talk about this outfit tomorrow when I'm getting dressed, but I just got a pink dress. I got to try this on. Hopefully, it fits from Amazon, and then I got some, like, head pieces and stuff to, like, go with the tea party theme. Okay, yeah, and that's not it. What is this one? Oh, this is a wig that I got a review, girl. I was not expecting this. It said it wasn't even delivered yet. I just don't know what is coming to my... Oh, this is cute. Okay, so this is going to be a separate video, but we got a wig as well. These are shoes that's going to be in a different video. And then this... Let me see what this is. Okay, yeah this is gonna be a separate video so i'm about to get to cooking um i'm hungry just got home i'm about to cook me a t-bone steak with some probably roasted potatoes and i want some macaroni and i also got some turnip greens so 
I'll probably cook that as well. Good morning, y'all. Um, I know I look crazy right now. <laughs> I got my dress on. I just got out the shower. I just shaved my legs and stuff. So I'm about to do a quick little bitty makeup look. Nothing too major because I am going to have on lashes and stuff. So I do need to do my eyebrows. It's 909. Janae is getting ready right now as well as we speak. So this dress is from Amazon. I'll give y'all a better look, but this is cute. Like for this purpose, little brunch outfit. I feel like I could wear this to church as well. Um. So yeah, and my eyebrows needs to be uh, like groomed. I'm sorry, I really don't see <laughs> how people wake up in the morning like is a morning person because it's not for me now when i have a lot of off days in a row y'all know i be having like nine ten off days in a row i can wake up early then because i know i got you know a lot of more days but I'm supposed to work today i just text one of my um guy friends co-workers or whatever to see if he wanted to work my shift today uh, before I call in I don't want to call in but I really don't feel like going today because I'll be off Sunday and I kind of want to have my whole Sunday as well as I work Monday so my schedule is kind of weird it's like I'm off then I work today off Sunday work Monday off Tuesday so I don't know but I really don't need to get no more call in like points to at it so i don't know we'll see i just text one person i'm gonna text somebody else and see if they want to work my shoe but we'll see yeah i'm about to throw on some lashes and i'm doing i did foundation concealer eyebrows and we're gonna throw on some lashes and uh what highlighter seconds to introduce themselves market yourself in any way possible that you see fit 30 seconds so keep your commercial clean and short you see what i'm saying everybody got that now y'all sound like y'all uncomfortable it's a, it's a networking event you see what i'm saying it's a networking event 
So it's cool. So to give you an example, I would come up to Nala as if I didn't know her. I'm like, how you doing? I'll tell Slick Nick, what you do for a living? I'm a Rodney. I'm a very good doctor. Okay, so what I do is I own a clothing company. I've been running it for five years. Mm. How long you been doing that? Okay, okay. And then the conversation will just naturally happen. It don't got to be awkward. It don't got to be, you know, it's, it's, it's okay. I promise you. Failure, this, this is absolutely helping two things. One, you get comfortable with yourself. You get confident. When y'all, everybody at this table, everybody that got tables, I'm pretty sure y'all have been talking to somebody your very first time, you was nervous, you didn't really know what to say, you kind of trying to get the jitters out. This is the part where you get the jitters out. Introduce yourself confidently. Let them know exactly what you do, man. I've been doing this for X, Y, and Z amount of years. You see what I'm saying? Now you're getting that practice of what it is that you do. So if y'all don't mind, without further ado, everybody come up to the front. Don't be so quick to walk away Dance with me, I wanna rock your body Please stay Dance with me, you don't have to admit you Wanna play Dance with me, just let me rock you Till it's We're mingling right now We got the business cards Nala, this is my graphic designer <laughs> All of her info will be down below, okay? <laughs> So you just want to be three? That's cool. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's got to be brave sometimes. You know? So we want to do a marketing pitch. Think about it as, let's say you're going you gotta market yourself to everybody. Shark Tank. Yeah, Shark Tank type vibes. Are y'all ready? And y'all, y'all gotta rate them. Y'all gotta rate them. If they good. Okay. Ooh, good job. Yeah. Don't they boo not, nobody. Don't boo them. We're working on ourselves. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give them the bougie guys. Like work on it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But they got up here confident, so I hope they really yeah, can come here. Yeah, give them the for even coming up here. Yeah, that's, that's, big, that's big. That's big. That's big. Hello, hello, hello. So my name is Natasha Riley. I own Calculated Moves CPA Firm. Um, it's a CPA firm that specializes in helping small business owners and real estate investors grow their profits, save on taxes, and leave a legacy. I've been accounting for over 10 years, so I'm not new to this. I'm used to this, okay? Come on, okay. But I have only been on my own, owning my own firm for the last year. I would love to connect with each and every last one of you all. My mission is to educate, inspire, and uplift other women like myself. So, so I would love to connect with you all. As well. Well, 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 well. <laughs> all right, that was good. Okay, give it. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, my name is Shalia Davis. I own Joyous Genie and Embroidery and Professional Branding Company. Um, if you have any need for your business, we do t-shirts, hats, tote bags, and we also do... Okay, so I wanted to show you guys my outfit. I don't know. I can't see right now, but the dress is from Amazon. I'll have it linked down below. It was super cute. Like, I feel like you can wear this to church. Like, you can make it go down a little bit further so it's like right above your knee right there and then the back goes all the way down so to your like calf muscles so i really like it the back is cute you can still wear this with a bra and then i like up here how it kind of still covers all of this and goes back i don't know i really like it um it was cute for the tea party i feel like you can wear this to church i mean i will wear it to church it looks fine to me uh, I did already take off my hair piece and stuff, but I'll pop in some videos, but I wanted to show y'all that. Um, and yeah, can't really get too comfortable because I do have to go to work today. So yeah, it was actually her birthday today. Um, the one who, 
Her name's Nala. She's my graphic designer. And yeah, it was her birthday, so happy birthday. We already told her that. I probably popped in a lot of videos and stuff by now. Um, but it was super fun. This was my first ever any type of like branding influencer type thing to go to. Not really influencer, it was more so for like people who have their own businesses. But I mean, since I am an influencer, have my own brand and stuff, it's kind of like one of those so it was super fun it was my first one it was somebody there from like dallas um somewhere else i forgot but yeah i think i want to go to some more of these i would like to go to some out of state um i would love to probably like sit in at some somebody's um seminar or something like that from like dallas or even atlanta i feel like that'd be a really good um marketing networking situation so yeah i'm tired i just took prints out <laughs> to go outside i'm pooped it is literally 4 30 i gotta be at work by 6 30. i usually leave the house at 6 so i literally have like an hour and 30 minutes to get ready for work and all of that so i'm tired i'm about to use 30 minutes to just chill for a second um or i may just go ahead and hop in the shower and then just chill until like 5 probably like 5 40 because i already took prints out and everything so yeah i'll probably get dressed around like 5 40 and then take my food that i cooked last night there i may take y'all with me um the way of this vlog i think i may try to make this vlog kind of like um a weekend or a week or something um like my last one like this was a work week in my life with being a content creator working like a six to six or six to seven so since this vlog kind of is basically about me you know going to like different like brand opportunities networking and kind of how i'm like balancing everything i may go ahead and take out with me tonight at work i am supposed to be um shadowing well not shadowing i'm supposed to be training a girl maybe that they trying to throw her on me so i don't know we'll see how much footage and stuff i can get but um, I may take y'all along with me. I may record like certain little bits and pieces just to kind of give y'all a feel. I still want to edit this one video that I plan to do. It was like a um, night of the life of like a PCT, my job at the hospital. Um, I have the footage. The footage is from like this year in April. Um, just me being in my head about stuff like having to like, you know, always look perfect or something like that. Just kind of what we was talking about at the little event today like just post like you know somebody's always watching it's cool like you know your stuff you'll learn as you grow and you know things will just get better as you keep doing them so i think i'm just going to go ahead and probably edit that tonight as well as maybe bring y'all along i don't know if i'm gonna bring my camera per se but i'll probably record a little bit of stuff um on like my phone like you know when i clock in the stuff you know just i'll just probably record some stuff um, tomorrow I am off, which is Sunday. I would like to stay up after I get off actually tomorrow to go to church. Um, but we'll see. I'm not even going to lie. If I work Saturday, nine times out of 10, normally I do not go to church the next day because I'd be so pooped, especially because at eight o'clock tomorrow morning, I will be up for 24 hours and my church doesn't start service until nine o'clock and then it ends at 10. Granted, I am off Sunday. It's like, you know, like this is really just excuses, but I just physically don't think I will be able to make myself stay up. Like, you know, I do not want to fall asleep in church. So I don't know. We'll see. But I would honestly like to go to church in the morning. Um, but yeah, Whew, I'm tired. I, my mouth is dry and we'll probably recap a little bit i'll probably plug in some um footage and stuff from the event and then probably like voiceover kira will tell y'all some stuff but yeah my apartment is a mess because i um packaged all of my collaboration stuff so my living room looks a mess that's all like sponsored content right here so i'm about to go ahead and hop in the shower and i'm gonna try to lay down and be in the bed by like five o'clock it's 4 33 and i'm about to take off this makeup it kind of messed up and stuff on my nose because of my glasses but i want to try to be in bed by like five o'clock so i can just chill and relax for about like 45 minutes and then get up and get ready for work hopefully i got some clean clothes like I said, that steak and macaroni and roast potatoes that I cooked last night, that's what I'm gonna take as my lunch tonight. Um, I'm also gonna take some snacks. So I have fruit snacks. 
I also have Cheez-Its. So I'm gonna put some of those in a Ziploc bag and take that as a snack for tonight. So hopefully, oh, tonight is a good night. I tried to get somebody to cover for me today, but the two guys that I asked, they were like, they can't do it. But one of my friends, Emmanuel, he was on my blog when he helped me move. Um, he said he'll work my Monday because basically I'm working today, Saturday. I'm going to be off Sunday. Then I work Monday, then off Tuesday. And then I go back Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So I don't really like the choppy in between. So I would much rather just be off on Monday or I would have liked to be off today. But anyways, I'm just rambling. I'm tired. My mouth is dry. I'm about to take off my makeup shower lay down and then i'll probably talk to y'all when i get to work or something like that. hello hello today is um sunday october 1st actually happy october 1st it is 7 19 in the evening um i woke up at three didn't really just get up until like five o'clock just to print out and everything so right now what i'm doing is i got alexa set for a one hour alarm right now and after I'm done cleaning for an hour, I'm gonna just be cleaning every room for an hour. Not like each room, but like one hour. I plan on recording a Amazon's favorites video tonight. Um, I wanted to record it earlier today so that I can have it up for today, which is Sunday, my normal uploading day, but it didn't happen that way. So I'm gonna record it tonight, doing my hair and makeup and stuff real quick, record that video. I was thinking about going ahead and knocking out the little she in haul video as well just to get those clips for that um i don't think i'm going to do a full youtube video for that because it's only six pieces and yeah i can just kind of create that into like a youtube shorts video per se um so yeah i'm just going to do like a tiktok what i bought versus what i got um so yeah you can use any platform for the um she and stuff so i do like <laughs> i do like that you can um do that so yeah I'm gonna clean for an hour and then do my video. I was playing last night at work like content. Um, I like to post every Sunday and Thursday. So that being said, every Sunday and Thursday of this month totals nine days. So I need at least nine videos. And in between those nine YouTube videos, I would like to actually post some TikToks, Reels, and Shorts videos on YouTube as well. And I want to do that kind of twice a week as well so then that means i would need nine additional youtube like nine additional like tiktoks and reels and stuff like that so i'm going to be probably i'm not probably going to plan tonight since i do need to get like these videos this video done and or she in video and i need to like clean and have my apartment ready for tomorrow tomorrow i do have a wig review i think i said that in the beginning of this vlog um, so I want to try to get that out the way in the morning because if I can't put the wig over my sewing, I'm going to have to take my sewing out because at this point I really, I want to take it out anyway because I'm tired of it. But yeah, if I can't put it over this, I'm just going to go ahead and take it out. Um, so yeah, then other than that, um, I have to do, I'll probably do a, I don't know. I need to do something with those shoes from the fence. Um, it said I've got to do a YouTube video, so I'll probably plug it into this one or the next one. I'm not sure yet. Um, or do like a YouTube shorts. I don't know. So I need to write down the rest of my collaborations and stuff like that. Kind of just plan out for content as well. Um, I wanted to show you guys this. So, you know, this is my YouTube studio office, whatever. So. This was from June, have not updated this since. So I like to use this chart for the days I work and the days my bills are due as like more so visual so I can see that. And I was thinking of putting that up right here. So the next chart that I have, these are content plans for June. Have not wrote anything since June. So content plans for June, I like to write down like my collabs, incoming collabs. I like to do TikToks and Reels ideas or what I would like to post in that month and then YouTube video ideas or what I would like to post. So I'm going to, some of these I didn't even do, but some of these I did. So I'm gonna erase this or take a picture of it and then write down what I didn't do. But my plan for that, tell me what y'all think. I'm gonna set y'all up right here. So over there on that wall, that's my high school diploma 
my degree from college and like other certificates and when I got baptized and stuff. So I was thinking of putting three pictures on this wall from my photo shoot since you know I run a hair business and stuff so I want to put three pictures of the photo shoot I was going to do a neon sign in here but I think I'm going to do that for my room because it just it just makes better sense to me and it looks better I already made like a mock-up of it so I'm going to put three pictures from the brand up there um and then over here I didn't know if I wanted to put these So, I was thinking of putting this right here, but I'm like, will that kind of throw off the vibe? Because I'm gonna have, you know, brand photos over here, and I kind of just want this wall to be like as pretty as possible. So, I would like to have this right here, but then I'm thinking like, okay, what if I just put it down here? And everything is kind of like at eye level. I can sit in my chair while I write over here, so, I don't know. I may put this right here. And there's not really another place that I would put this. I still have to finish this wall with the wallpaper because I was thinking of putting it over here, but I do sometimes record content over here and I don't wanna have to keep taking these down and moving them every time I wanna kinda get a cute shot over here, like aesthetically pleasing shot. So that's why I'm not gonna put it on this wall but yeah comment down below i think y'all are probably going to say put it under my um like certificates and stuff like that diplomas and degrees so i may end up just putting it right here and then we'll see because i do need this hanging up it's literally just been sitting down like on the floor or a table and that's not helping me so we're going to be updating these either tonight or tomorrow because like i said it's already 7 25 and I really need to do this Amazon video. I'm about to eat a little pizza real quick. And then after I cook this little pizza, this one, I'm going to um, heat up the rest of my leftovers, my T-bone steak. I did take that to work with me yesterday, but I still have some left. Like that T-bone steak was big, girl. So I'm gonna eat the rest of that food. And tomorrow I really would like to wake up early, like early, eight, seven o'clock to try to get this wig stuff out of the way. And it's also a frontal, so frontals take me 10,000 years to complete. If it was a closure, closure wig take me, like the whole process probably take like an hour and a half to two hours. A frontal would be dang near like three to four hours long, so yeah i'll talk to y'all when i'm done cleaning because i've been talking to y'all for a minute so i've been talking to y'all for seven minutes and that seven minutes gone on my one hour timer